All-American, the honor by which individual college football players are measured. 35 players in Mizzou football history have achieved All-American status. 25 hailed from the state of Missouri. Our recruiting base starts in Missouri. And whether that's Kansas City, St. Louis, I mean, there's a lot of personal pride that those guys have. And I think being part of the show me state, you know, I think that uh, Coach Odom stamped that moniker on our football team and said, you know, show me, you gotta show up and do it. I'm from the show me state. Since Andy Hill returned to his alma mater as an assistant coach in 1996 and started leading the recruiting charge for many of those show me state stars, all Americans from the state of Missouri have fueled some of Mizzou's greatest moments. Shane Ray, you talk Justin Smith, you're talking, I mean, even go back to Rob Reedy, um, talking Martin Rucker, Chase Kaufman. Although there's a lot of guys within either the Kansas City metro area, St. Louis metro area, that are just outstate guys. Uh, Devin West from Moberly, Missouri. There's a lot of guys here that, that came here, have made a huge impact, and, and continue to make an impact. With the men he's coached and the moments he's witnessed, Hill could go on for hours on the exploits that led to these players getting their portraits on the All-American wall. There's Jefferson City's Justin Smith. Back then we still had three days of freshman only practices and uh, we got full pads on and he hit one of the other freshman offensive linemen so hard the guy said I would like to quit football. St. Louis native Jeremy Macklin. When you're a freshman All-American, I mean that's, that's one thing, when you're an All-American as a freshman, that's totally different and he was a two-time All-American. He's a total package as far as intelligence and wanting to be great. Shane Ray from Kansas City. He played with a chip on his shoulder. Sheldon Richardson kind of kept challenging him. Sheldon was an older player when, when Shane was a young guy. And who could forget the way Martin Rucker from St. Joe Moe and Chase Kaufman from Peculiar helped reinvent the college tight end position during the mid-2000s. You're sitting, you know, never really attached to, to a tackle like a conventional tight end. They're always split out. So they're out in space and those guys made plays. I mean, you're talking about I think Kaufman left here with 247 catches, splitting time most of his career here. Rucker was just such a great leader, and you gave that guy in the ball, he was determined to make something, somebody move the other way. I remember a fourth down against Kansas in the big game in 2007. We threw a quick screen to him, and you could have put a brick wall in front of that, and he would have busted through it to get the, the touchdown. All the names from over the years, whether it's big stars from big cities or small town sensations from outstate Missouri, there's one thing they all have in common. They're Show Me State Tigers for life. They have a love for the university, great work ethic, a person who cares about whether the black and gold wins every Saturday. In present day and 50 years down the road, they're gonna feel the same way. And so those guys come here with such a special bond to this Columbia community that uh, it never goes away.